Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Becca. If you are new here, I am a stay-at-home mom of two little guys. Today we are just gonna jump right on into the video. So as you will see here, we woke up pretty early. I woke up first before anybody around 6.30 and I just decided if you are a mommy and you are at home, sometimes you know just on the weekends you just wake up and you're like, okay, I have a million and ten things to do today or you're just in the mood. So surprisingly, I actually started laundry before I even made my coffee, and that is rare in my home. <laughs> I absolutely love coffee, so grab some if you are going to be cleaning with me. I love to start my laundry right away, just so that I know. I feel like I'm doing two things at once, even though the machine is doing all of the work for me. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and start in mine in my husband's bedroom. I'm going to go ahead and change the sheets, get those in the washer in the next load, and then I will work a little bit on our bathroom. I had just deep cleaned our bathroom and I'm just going to touch whatever needs to be kind of wiped down in here, nothing too crazy, and then we'll just kind of make our way through the house. I'm going to have you guys spend the day with me, so a little bit of a grocery haul. I'll show you some things that I actually thrifted this weekend. I am so excited about finding thrifted Christmas decor, so stick around, don't forget to subscribe, and I hope that you enjoyed this video. product i've never used this product before i am a little surprised i've been using it for about a week and i do think that it does help cut down a little bit of the soap scum in the shower conditioner soap you name it it all just builds up in the shower and i feel like when i go to scrub especially the bottom of the shower pan the buildup is just it takes a long time so i'm just looking for a way to kind of cut that down especially in the shower doors so if you've used this product let me know how you like it or if you have a particular product that you do love definitely let me know down below
I'm gonna give the windows a super quick wipe down. I haven't done that in a week or two, so definitely needed to be done. I absolutely love the view from the sofa, just gazing out at this tree. When we purchased our home, this was one of the reasons why I fell in love with our house and the property. And so every time I get to just look out the windows and sit, if you are a mommy, you know you're always on your toes, even when I'm cleaning the windows, it's just a really sweet reminder. You guys the window tracks were absolutely just so dirty i need to get in here with um like a toothbrush or something and really scrub them but that's for another day sometimes you just do what you need to do and move on to the next task <laughs> so i actually found an estate sale or a garage sale you can see the dirt it was just building up hooray for my husband he came in with coffee and groceries i'm gonna unload those but I found an estate sale this weekend or a garage sale. I don't remember which one it was, but we live in a really small town. So anytime there's a garage sale, I, for some reason, don't get there in time or I miss it. We just have things going on. And so I was super excited to go to this one. You guys, I found the most beautiful vintage village pieces. I absolutely love Christmas villages. So I'm really excited to add those to our collection. Really quick grocery haul. We picked up milk, ground beef. We're running low in the freezer. So we just like to stock up when we can. My husband picked up hummus. My sons and my husband absolutely love hummus. For me, it's like hit and miss. <laughs> we picked up cilantro, the Faye Greek yogurt. I think my husband said these are called pluots, plum quads. I don't remember. Um, a few lemons, some bananas, nectarines, butter, eggs, and bacon bits. Let me know down below, do you like to cook bacon or do you use bacon bits? I definitely do not like to cook bacon. <laughs> um, some brown sugar, peanut butter. My sons absolutely love these for breakfast as well as my husband. They're really good, but they come in a ton of different flavors. Um, we needed some salad. I love having salad bags on hand and then some Rice Krispies, and my husband picked out a few of these energy drinks. Nothing too major in this grocery haul, but we just needed a few things to hold us over for the weekend, for the week, the upcoming week, and we always pick up donuts on the weekend, especially when we have everything going on, like cleaning and outside work and just kind of like a busy day. It's a really simple breakfast with a piece of fruit and some yogurt. I'm gonna go ahead and put these groceries away and then we will move back into cleaning. So I needed to make some space in the fridge. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some hard boiled eggs onto, or I'm gonna throw eggs onto the stove so that they can cook down and then I'll have hard boiled eggs for a few days for breakfast or for sandwiches, anything like that, put on a salad. Definitely just a really easy way to make sure that they don't go bad and I can't put them in my garden. I know that if you put eggs in your tomato plants, they sprout so well. I did that last year, but we don't have a fall garden this year. Just listen. 
So before I get into this mountain of laundry that I've been so subtly avoiding for the last two days, here are a few of the villages that I actually picked up. And to my surprise, they were, you guys, in perfect condition. Some of them had the extra light bulbs that haven't been touched in 20 some odd years. I was just so excited to find these. This piece in particular, this reminds me of our front yard the first year that we were in our home. If there was like a massive snowstorm and my husband and I were awake like in the middle of the night and we saw the deer under the tree it's just a really special memory so when I saw that I had to have it and then I just thought that these were all really cute and I think they were all under five dollars so it was a massive steal <laughs> so I'm really excited to include them to our Christmas decor this year I just cannot wait to see these Okay, so now I'm going to share a super quick chicken soup recipe and I promise my chicken soup changes every time I make it, but it always turns out really well. I kind of just throw everything in there across my fingers and hope that the crock pot does things magic. <laughs> so I put an entire um, can or canister of the bone broth and I thought that it would just kind of help. Everybody was a little bit under the weather, so why not add something extra? I did put a one chicken breast. I wanted something really light. I really wanted just hot broth for everybody. I put probably about an entire bag of the already pre-sliced celery, one bag of mini carrots, and I put an entire bouillon cube, one of the larger ones. I threw in about three or four bay leaves, a bunch of Italian seasoning. We love really peppery soup in my house. I threw in three potatoes and Honestly, any seasoning that I think sounds good at the time, I throw it in there and <laughs> I wanted this to cook by lunchtime, so I started it in the morning. I set it on high for about three and a half hours. It came out so good. It was perfectly tender. The chicken wasn't overcooked and the broth was just definitely something that we all needed and we definitely ate it for like breakfast, lunch, and dinner for a few days. Now we'll get back to the laundry. Okay, so now that the laundry is folded, I'm gonna go ahead and put everything away and then head into my son's bathroom and then straighten up in here. Oh, you know it's true. No matter where I go, I'm coming home to you. 
Okay guys, I think that's going to wrap up today's video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. If you did make it this far, don't forget to subscribe. I would love it if you say hello down below. I will see you guys on Thursday. I know that my uploads last week were a little bit spotty. So now that everybody is feeling better and our house is kind of back into its normal rhythm, I will be uploading Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday this week. So thanks for hanging in with me there. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like videos, the cleaning videos with a little bit of everything in them. Let me know down below if there's anything you'd like to see during this change of season. I feel like Christmas is around the corner. I will see you guys on Thursday.